Hello and welcome to another Pi presentation video. Uh, let's start the uh, presentation of 1960s unsmoked Austrian Andreas Bauer pipes block munitions with the first one I've posted. It came in the black box which says block munition and it's just this lovely, lovely straight apple shape. Um, <clears throat> inside a bit of dirt you see right there just gonna clean that additionally probably fell into that into there when I was uh, moving it around all in all box does have some small signs of aging and wear but it's still in great condition and serves the purpose exactly as it should ha ah, pipe itself um, I honestly get amazed every single time when I get a Bauer pipe smoked or unsmoked it doesn't really make much of a difference but it is of course always better to get it unsmoked um, I mean the top range series like this one with the true amber stems they are just the pinnacle of mission pipe making carving whatever you want to call it and they're just top-notch when it comes to quality First, let's address the issue, uh, issue the thing with the uh, metal on metal tenon. Um, why is this so good? First, it's always gonna fit nicely. Second, if it ever becomes loose by some miracle, you can just put something in between there and spread it. Same goes for the uh, opposite side, you know, shrinking it. And it's always better to have a connection like this, which is reliable, durable, and will work forever, you know. And plus, when you have something as sensitive as amber, just look at that beautiful color. Uh, it's gonna, um, you know, bond with amber correctly and um, it's not gonna endanger it in any possible way. I mean, amber is really sensitive to work with. It provides a special sensation when smoking it and it's just one of the best materials you can use, if not the best, when it comes to uh, smoking, making smoking pipes. Awesome color. It's yellowish, but it's, you know, closed yellowish, stronger yellowish, uh, not so strong, not so bright, and it just looks uh, amazing. Uh, the um, I was trying to uh, remember word or figure of word that would say you know the, the finished production the, the, the finish itself with these blocks the way they uh, finish off edges and uh, flat surfaces is just so good I mean when you compare this one for example to the uh, one with the plastic stem difference between missions is just so especially when you compare it with a Turkish pipe difference with between mirrors is huge I don't know which process they use to uh, get uh, dense fine quality mirrors like this I mean the finished blocks but it definitely shows a difference and uh, it feels like a perfect egg if I can say it like that there's a small dot right there as you can see which was probably uh, which occurred in production and it just feels like a perfect egg uh, of finest quality and uh, I'm sure these pipes are just amazing smokers. Uh, you can still find new, uh, of course, uh, Bowers, uh, simple shapes like this one with the true amber stems. They are a bit expensive. When I say a bit expensive, you can say four, five hundred dollars for something like this. I figured I'm gonna go cheaper. I might as well could have said you know 500 for this one instead of three and the others but I wanted to keep it realistic and um, make a fair price if I can say it like that it's definitely worth more uh, just when you hold it and especially when you smoke it you, you will understand why these pipes are just um, top of the notch fantastic block mirrors. Let's place it back in the box. I was breaking it a lot so um, it took a while but trust me it's worth every penny. Uh, that would be all for this short presentation. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you in the next one.